The Chart of the Week is presented by Glassnode, the leading on-chain intelligence platform. In today's Chart of the Week, we're examining our entity-adjusted URPD chart to pinpoint where investors have clustered their investments and where some potential support and resistance levels might lie. We've used different variations of this chart in some of our previous videos as well. But just to give you a very brief overview, this chart shows the prices the current set of Bitcoin UTXOs were last created. So in other words, each bar that we see here shows the amount of existing Bitcoin that was last moved within that specific price range. So first off, we can see a significant accumulation of coins between 25k and 31k, suggesting a strong support zone around the 30k mark. If you remember from our previous videos, this is the zone that was dominated by short-term holders, where we saw a bulk of this new demand enter the market. And now that the price is around 20% higher than the cost basis of this cluster, at least some of these investors are more likely to accumulate into their cost basis rather than sell should these levels be retested. Just above this cluster, we can see a bit of a gap here between 31 and 33k, suggesting fewer transactions were made at this range, and this poses as a potential weak spot. If price were to fall below this 33k mark, then we could be looking at 30 as the next line of defense. So for traders, this 30 to 31k range is crucial as it's really the battleground between recent gains and the largest supply cluster, and any drop below this could really trigger some sell-offs. So it's definitely worth keeping a close eye on this level for potential buy or sell signals. Beyond this small gap, we have a large cluster of coins that last moved between 33 and 35k, which does signal some fresh demand. And we're currently sitting just above this with Bitcoin's price around 37k. Above us, up to 40, is heavy with investors from the 2021-2022 cycle, who could be looking to break even after spending a fair amount of time underwater. And if this is the case, then breaking past 40 could prove to be challenging without a significant influx of demand. On the other hand, if these long-term holders are less sensitive to price fluctuations, especially after holding through the last two years, then they may be holding out for higher returns, potentially even waiting until we reach previous all-time highs. So taking everything into account, you can see how the entity adjusted URPD chart gives us a great lay of the land, enabling investors to visualize the landscape around Bitcoin's current price and helping them navigate any future price moves. We really appreciate everyone that watches our content on the Glassnode channel. As always, if you have any questions, please drop them below and we can do our best to answer them. We also encourage you to visit our new discretionary trading landing page where you can explore our offerings and also schedule a demo where one of Glassnode's leading experts can show you the practical value of on-chain analysis for trading and investing at an institutional level. Until next week, we'll be back with more on-chain insights from Glassnode.